An intense overnight fire destroys a North St. Louis church in the Walnut Park neighborhood. But as Fox 2's Chris Renier reports, a symbol of hope survived the flames and the church's evangelist is vowing to move forward. It's a bit surreal and um, uh, disheartening and uh, even discouraging. That is Christopher Mitchell reacting to the fire, which destroyed the church where he is the evangelist. This is all that's left of the St. Louis Metropolitan Church of Christ on West Florissant at Mimica. Mitchell says the building's owner was inside and made a simple mistake that sparked the flames. Well, she was watching the news and, and, and she was cooking and uh, she fell asleep and unfortunately a pot caught on fire and uh, that's how things began. Firefighters got the call just after two Wednesday morning. Shortly after arriving at the scene, a second alarm was sounded. Then this happened. Loud horns went off, the signal for all firefighters to evacuate the building. Given the intensity of the fire, given the location of the fire, we were forced to uh, transition from an offensive attack to a defensive attack. The building's owner was already outside when fire crews first arrived. Authorities did evacuate residents from a house on one side of the church and an apartment on the other side. Fortunately, nobody was hurt. And in the rubble, a sign of hope. The outline of a cross which used to be on one of the church walls. The symbol giving teeth to church members like Corliss Burton, who was shaken when she saw the fire's aftermath. It's worse than what I thought. I didn't think it would be this bad, so it caught me. It really caught me off guard. But that cross is still, is still there. So he's got, he's got a plan. Chris Renier, Fox News. Down, and we're standing in the ashes of our shame when angels cry. I'll be the first to extend my hand to you, and, to you. and forgiveness will begin to heal our wounds. It's time to see this eye to eye, brown or yellow, black or white, from these burning embers we can rise. And the love for your brother no longer matters. Now our faith is on the ground. The house of God is burning down. And we're standing in the ashes of our shame. Oh, oh.